What is up everybody? Welcome back to another video. Hope y'all have an amazing day as usual. So today we are at the beautiful Branch Brook Park in Newark as you guys can see and today we are going to be doing a food review. But before we get into today's video make sure to click the like button. Make sure to smash that like button. I just said that twice. <laughs> Okay, make sure to click the like button, make sure to click the subscribe button, and always comment down below. It turns out that 75% of the people that watch my videos are not subscribed, which is a little upsetting. So click the subscribe button. So we are here um, by the Aletha Gibson tennis courts here at Branch Brook Park in Newark. And we're just a couple blocks, not even a block away, it's right, right around the corner, um, from Chris Red Hot, which is a place where you can get hot dogs in Branch Brook Park, and it is a food truck. We have not done any reviews for a food truck. The reason why I know about this food truck is because they have a page on TikTok with 60,000 followers, and I'm like, I live pretty close to Newark, so why not try it? Um, and I was at the supermarket yesterday at ShopRite, and I saw... Um, mango pepsi and i was like hmm, that's gonna be a pretty good food review so i also got a mango pepsi at a nearby dollar store uh and when i was at the dollar store um there was i guess a, i guess a regular customer was there and they were talking about how they got like someone tried to rob him in the morning <laughs> that, that that sounds like newark to me <laughs> that's that, that that's newark for you right there <laughs> there's always something going on in newark shootings shootouts drug deals it's there's a lot of crime in newark um so anyways let's get that off our minds so um i got a classic hot dog with uh, ketchup and mustard and some onions and i believe some relish i can't uh completely remember but um this place has 4.9 stars on google maps so they're they are i mean it's pretty much impossible for a place to have five stars exactly five stars they had 4.9 so that's technically five star this is five star right here so i really hope it lives up to the hype M G. Look at that, people. Doesn't look good, but <laughs> there's so much stuff on here. This is this is perfect for two fifty. This is two fifty, people. What you get for two fifty? That's pretty impressive, right there. Let's try it. One, two, three. Mmm. 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 That's really good. It's a little spicy. I don't know, maybe they put like some seasoning in the, um, the hot dog itself, but I got ketchup and mustard. I don't really taste the mustard, but the lot of relish and relish is really good. So, mm. yeah, you know, they, 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 they do not drip out here. Look at this. Look at this people. Nothing but the best. Look at that. Newark's finest. Mm. Now, Newark is not really known for its street food, but there's a lot of food trucks, at least in this part of Newark. You have food trucks all across Bloomfield Avenue, and then you have some on Broadway. You have a lot of food trucks in Newark, some in the park, some on Park Avenue. I don't think, I haven't seen any in downtown, but then you also have street vendors that have like ice cream in the summer, so. Hmm. Now, Business Insider ranked Newark as the worst city in America to raise a raise a family. But, I mean, <laughs> come on. I mean, there's literally street vendors on almost every corner in the summer serving ice cream. And there's food trucks everywhere. How is it the worst? Mm. So this, I, don't, I don't care. This is good. Mm. <coughs> mm. I got caramelized onions on the... Um, Hot dog. And, they, and, and you have the option of getting it in a bag and they use paper bags so that's pretty cool um okay so now we're now on to the pepsi part of this food review look at this beautiful bottle it is mango as you can see and it has orange and blue to represent pepsi so let's see what that fizz freaking fly on my camera L listen to this fizz right here i hope it doesn't i hope it doesn't fizz up but listen to this. Ooh, that sounds nice, doesn't it? Okay. Oh, it smells very tropical. Pepsi Mango. Beautiful bottle. Let's see what it tastes like. And it also looks a lot lighter than most Pepsis do. Let's try it. Cheers. <laughs> that is sharp. That is good. Wow. 
That's really good. Oh my god. That is fire right there, people. Pepsi mango. Who would have thought? I, I, I would have thought if, if you told me that Pepsi had mango, like, if, you, if someone told me that and it tasted good, I wouldn't really, I, I'd believe them, but I'd kind of be surprised at the same time. But this stuff is honestly really good. By the way, if I could rate the hot dog out of five, I'd give it a four. And out of ten, I'd give it an eight. There's just, I taste more toppings than I do um, the hot, actual hot dog itself. But it still tastes good. And this Pepsi right here, I'd give it a four out of five as well. It's a little sharp. Maybe once more the fizz comes out. I don't like flat soda, but I just don't like it extremely fizzy either. I don't know. We'll have to see. But for right now, I give it an 8 out of 10. And a 4 out of 5. Mm. Actually, I'll give it a 4.5. Pepsi's always blessing us with new drinks. You gotta love Pepsi for that. Mm. Pepsi over Coke any day. I highly recommend this. So I'm gonna keep, I'm gonna keep this food review short. I hope everyone enjoyed. By the way, before we end today's video, um, it is cherry blossom season. As you guys can see behind me is a cherry blossom tree, and that's what Branchburg Park is famous for. In fact, Newark and Belleville are number one in the country for um, the most um, cherry blossom trees, and they're gorgeous. Look at that. I mean, doesn't it look really nice. I love them, and I thought that'd be a good video background. It's not going to be it. So that's going to be it. Make sure to like, subscribe. God bless all you guys.